y'all. Back. Yeah, so. I am a random person. So, I try to stick to one topic, but sometimes if I'm talking and I think about something else in between, I'm going to tell y'all. I know I'm crazy. But, like I said, my phone thing is not steady. This is just a little temporary to get some type of content going while I'm driving. So eventually I'm going to get the one to stick to my windshield or whatever. But anywho. All this stuff that I got in my storage, and not to mention there's furniture too, like stuff that my baby or my kids have grown out of. So I, um, I have an eBay account. I sell a lot of that stuff on. I just make sure that they are, you know, if I'm gonna sell them for, I'm gonna sell them for a pretty penny. Not a lot, of course, on eBay. They're used, but they look really good and they cost money. So. I'm not saying they no Louis Vuitton, no Gucci, or nothing like that. But they were definitely something, especially the clothes with tags that ain't been worn. Put my stuff on eBay. I was banned from eBay for a while. Um, I got, like, bed frames, twin-size bed frame. I got a, a full-size bed frame. I got a... Uh, a high chair that baby grew out of. Um, I got a bike that Nene got too big for. Um, you know, stuff like that. Not to mention, take care of my sister. She have her supplies of um, the pins and stuff like that. Chucks, stuff for the bed, gloves and all that stuff. And they keep coming and they keep coming. So I got all that stuff just in there because our home right now is not big enough for all this stuff. At some point, there's a spare room upstairs. And at some point, a lot of that stuff was just in the spare room as we moved in. But we've been there for three years and last year I got tired of it and I started taking the good stuff to the storage. So long story short I, I need to make a video for y'all me trying to pick through some of that stuff I'm gonna make a video for y'all of me um, getting some stuff ready to sell on eBay or any of that stuff so let me know what y'all interested in too <laughs> I really feel silly about this thing that keeps swinging back and forth like this. It's tripping me out. But I'd like to know what kind of content y'all want to see. Well, that's a pretty color. I'm still trying to figure out how to flip my camera around too. Cause I'll be seeing people do that. I don't see Naren button on here that tells me to flip my camera around so you can see the other way. I ain't got no iPhone, but not yet, but I got a pretty good phone. It costs a nice penny and it does a lot of cool stuff, but I haven't figured that part out yet. I have a sister. I'm the youngest of 10, y'all. My mother had 10. My father had two. He had me and my sister, who's who I take care of right now. So one of my sisters, who still lives in Indy, she's a pastor. And she has like 
things at the church, giveaways or community or whatever. I don't know what my baby is watching, but it is so loud. And she keep watching it over and over. But anyway. My sister is a minister. And I'm going to go home and make a video for y'all of me boxing up a bunch of that stuff. Show you some of the uh, idea of some of the stuff that I have. Mostly toys right now. And I'm going to box it up and I'm going to send it to her so she can have a community event and give it away. I hope to be there. But with my sister, it's hard. I mean, we could travel in the truck. We have. But it's just hard to get me and my kids together and her and all of her extra stuff that's needed. No, we have, like I said. And it has been a ball. Once, it's, once we there and situated, it, it was so much fun. But I just need to be able to... Bust a move without all the extra responsibility. I don't know if that's the right word. Not really responsibility, but luggage. I don't know. Not in a bad way, literally. Because there's so many bags. But I just wish I could be there when she have a community event to get that stuff away. Because I want to be like, I want to see people's faces. I thought about making bags for the homeless up here in the country where I stay. But these people up here are something else, let me tell you. So, I don't really want to put myself out there like that. So that if they see me out and about alone without hubby or with my kids or anything they not trying to I don't know I think about the worst case scenario sometimes not all the time because I don't live in fear I don't run around thinking like that but sometimes you have to especially nowadays it's ridiculous I guess I'm going back home I don't really think I need anything else right now I got um I've had Walmart Plus delivery since like October 2021 and man, that's the best thing that ever happened to me. That stuff is $10 a month. Free delivery, same day delivery. It might be later in the day. It might be 3 or 4 p.m. But shoot, that's perfect. If I need stuff to, that if I need, you know, if I got a freezer full of meat, and it's, it's frozen, and I forgot to take out something for dinner. I can go on Walmart.com and be like, I mean Walmart.com, Walmart Plus, and be like, you know, bring me some ribs and some barbecue sauce and the uh, mashed potatoes and everything else to go with it. Bring me that, and they'll bring it, and then it'll be there in time for me to start dinner. So I use that probably too much. Like I said, I shop a lot, but I shop more for my girls and my house and food and hair hair supplies more than hair Nini um, has really thick hair it, the shrinkage is real and she likes to yell and scream and be all upset when she get her hair down so we try to do protective styles as much as possible I'm gonna try to make some videos or some clips or something of me doing her hair I've done Journey's friends hair before, but yeah, I don't really, I'm just not that girl. I got purses, I got Michael Kors purses and Fendi purses, and I don't even know if those, if those names are a thing anymore, but those were, they were gifts. I do got a Gucci purse for my sister, but they were gifts, y'all. I do not buy that kind of stuff. But I ain't gonna say I wouldn't if I was able to pay everything and maybe have a couple dollars left, you know, something like that. But savings and all that. But you see our cars, we don't. And that's because they're cash. Uh, you know, that's the best way to go for me and mine right now. 
I definitely have some things to work towards. I'm not gonna say I have the perfect routine, but I am work on, working on making my routine perfect. But my kids are happy and they have everything that they want and need and, and probably too much more than that. I love to shop on Amazon. I love shopping Walmart Plus. I like going to like Ross and shoe stores and stuff like that. Walmart, of course. But as far as clothes and stuff, Burlington, Ross, just the, just the normal simple stuff. I don't even think they got a city trans up here where I live. I miss, I remember Rainbow and Indy, Miss Rainbow. We got a Charlotte Roos in the mall. Love that place for they pumps back in the day, y'all. I have never been the hill type of person. I've always wore pumps. And back in the day, I had every pair of flat pumps imaginable. Hey, let me tell the truth. Sometimes I bought them things uh, a half a size too small just because they were so cute and they matched something that I was wearing and I wanted them. I ain't had no kids, y'all. Back then, I used to shop like that. But... I started, you know, I've been a mother since 24, so it's been a while since I've done that. But, man, Charlotte Roos got the best pumps every color. These people cannot drive. I'm getting hungry driving past all these food places. I'm about to go home and get me, probably make me a steak and an egg. They got these box steaks at Walmart, y'all. These box steaks at Walmart with a flipped egg. Uh, over medium egg. It gotta be running for me. But it can't, I don't want my white to be all, I don't want my white runny, I want my yellow runny. I want my white cooked. <laughs> That's what you call over medium. So, that just sounds so good right now. And I'm out of orange juice. I just went to the store yesterday. And got all that stuff for Easter and birthday party. And even dinner last night. And forgot orange juice, y'all. Oh, mom, I'm gonna kill you. No, no, please don't nope. tell mom. Please don't tell Back mom. home. But. What's going on? Yeah, I didn't cook last night. We had uh, pizza and chicken strips. My kids thought they was partying at the movies. We was watching Everybody Hates Chris and Ridiculousness and <laughs> just chilling, hanging out together. I'm remember to grab my chapstick on my way back up in this thing. So I'm still in my uh, chill lounging clothes because I'm a stay at home mom and I live in the country and I'm presentable and I'm clean. Uh, but I ain't. I'm not flashy. I'm not flashy at all, y'all. But I can. I do clean up very well, very nice. I got to learn how to look at this camera though. So, I'm going to get up out of here, and I hope that you liked this video, and like, and subscribe, and share, and I'm about to get some content together for y'all, because I'm excited. I'm motivated now. Um, I've been watching y'all. I've been watching so many videos to learn things from y'all, and I'm just here for it. I'm here for the motivation. I'm here for the generational wealth. Uh, I'm here for the single moms club not single moms I'm sorry stay at home moms club I'm here for y'all I want to see y'all hacks what's up you got cleaning hacks you got uh, get the kids quiet hacks take some time alone hacks I'm, I'm, I'm here for it I want to see all that so I love you and I appreciate you being here and I'll see you on the next one